In this video, I will show how to use the TID4 to convert a percent to a decimal and simplified fraction. The main thing to remember is percent means per 100, and therefore we write a percent as a fraction with the denominator of 100. For the first example, we have 15%, which means 15 per 100, and therefore the fraction is 15 over 100. And now we will simplify this on the T84, as well as find the decimal form of 15%. So going to the calculator, remember a fraction bar means division. We enter 15 divided by 100, enter, which gives us the decimal for 15%. 15% is equal to 0 0.15. And now to find the simplified fraction for 15%, we press math, enter, enter. And notice how the simplified fraction for 15% is 3 20th. If we get the same fraction we entered, that means the fraction does not simplify. Next we have 4%, which means 4 per 100. As a fraction, we have 4 over 100. Going back to the T84, to find the decimal, we enter 4 divided by 100, enter, which gives us 0 0.04. And now to find the simplified fraction, we press math, enter, enter, which gives us 1 25th. Next, we have 0.02% which to begin as a fraction is 0 0.02 over 100. Going back to the calculator, we enter 0 0.02 divided by 100, enter. And notice how here we have 2e negative 4. This is scientific notation, which means 2 times 10 to the power of negative 4. Let's go ahead and write that down. We need to convert this to decimal notation because we're multiplying by 10 to the power of negative 4, we begin with 2, where the decimal point is to the right of the 2, and then move the decimal point four places to the left. So 1, 2, 3, 4. We fill in the missing digits with zeros, which gives us 0 0.0002, or more commonly 0 0.0002. And now to find the simplified fraction, we press math, enter, enter, which gives us one five thousandth. For the last example, we have 248%, which is a fraction to begin is 248 over 100. Going back to the calculator one more time, we enter 248 divided by 100 which gives us 2.48, which is the decimal form of 248%. To find the simplified fraction, once again, we press math, enter, enter, which gives us 62 25ths. I hope you found this helpful.